speeding up a little bit. One hundred. Well, we know what you're thinking. Everyone's thinking it. James Wade will win from here. James Wade will level the match on throw. The pie man has stalled. Sixty. Can he regather himself, Andy Smith? The three-set lead has been cut to three-one and now to three-two. His advantage is hanging by a thread all of a sudden. And in fact, James Wade is now favourite to win the match with the bookmakers at two to one on. We recall one three nil to Smith, Andy Smith was four to one on. Well, certainly what Smith's got to do, he's just got to stay focused. He's just got to hope for a couple of real Six electrifying legs. A couple of 12 darters back to back, which this man is more than capable of doing. But he's just lost the power scoring that he had in the early three sets. He's just, I mean, he hasn't hit a 140 for possibly Four two, two or even three legs now. He's hitting a lot of fives and treble fives also, isn't he? single fives now and four treble fives they start to get very very expensive as the match wears on Rod don't they they certainly do and Smith starting to get a little bit edgy and James Way can see that 95 he knows all about reading the demeanor of his opponent and I tell all the youngsters especially my son don't show weakness you know hitting bad shots just get up there get the darts out of the board quickly walk back quickly if you're going to curse yourself, do it behind his back. Don't show any Don't weakness whatsoever. 20 for tops, then. Fifty. Rare miss. And you require one hundred. Four times in the match so far, from seven attempts. Andy Smith had a one-six-one. One. He's now lagging so far behind. He's having to take out shots like one-five-one. One treble 17 long long way away 97 James you require 20 Game four times James Wade's James favorite double second double leg 10 leg has bailed him out Game in this on. match well, Smith's had a few miscounts in this game which He's not renowned for doing that. I mean, he went 74 there and goes for the treble 20. This should have been the 14's route. The treble 14 would left him double 16. And he's just, like I said earlier on, he's just starting to overheat a bit. I mean, this is the first match of the night here, day 11. So when they first come on the 16. stage, the heat's not revving up. Of course, now we're at the sixth set. We're hour into play. The crowd putting a lot of heat into the roof here, and gradually it comes down and seats onto that stage. So Smith has got to stay cool. 96. Maximum. What a man, For your 21st, 140 plus score. I think that's the first 140 he's hit for, for possibly five legs now. It just shows you how much Smith's come off the boil. And you can see that James Wade on those 140s is starting to get nearer and nearer to the 21 hit from James Wade, uh, from Andy Smith, sorry. Well, he's, he's got to come out now. 95. I'd have 
back in the 65 to leave you know the 25 would have left that 65 two darts again and a double it's a long Continue. way off in this leg and he requires 70. 70 left then 16 left nothing left Game what all left. in legs and andy smith yeah, andy smith was saying after his uh, first game against steve brown Game that he had a little bit of a, a bit of a cold didn't feel too good and that may still be lingering around we've seen a few players suffering up there we uh, robert thornton was one of the really good in the right two and eight robert thornton didn't he Paul Hunt really was suffering up there Fulton. produced a wonderful performance but he really was unwell robert and, uh, maybe andy's still suffering a little bit up there and the longer you stay up there the harder it gets 85. yes and as you mentioned earlier on andy smith's been missing too many big numbers it really is costly at the moment has allowed James Wade to get back into this game and now he's gradually getting better and better Wade. Smith has really got to he's got to dig deep he's got to find something perhaps a maximum will help him oh yes it will for a piece on the maximum front Three sets to two to Andy Smith is the most important stat. Wade with the darts looking to level this match up in this set. Can he win another last set shootout just as he did in the first round? Andy Smith left the two dart combination. If Wade can't get rid of this 124. 14 leaves the ball, the double lead, the treble leaves double 11. One and right out two. And you require Well, if Andy six. Smith is going to win this match, this is the sort of check out. He's given himself a brilliant chance with the 180, 140. Will he go double 18? He's gone for the treble 20. Now he has been pretty tidy on the double eight to break the throw of Wade. And he's busted it. That's unbelievable. Time to require 22. Well, it will be unforgivable if James Wade misses because Andy Smith will have to go right back to the foot of the mountain again on 96. Game Doesn't James matter now. That is not a job. Wade goes 2 1 up. In legs in this set. Bosti scored twice in this match, Rod, hasn't he? Once on 25, and then once there on 96. 91. Yeah, and at the end of the game, if Wade does go on to win this, Smith will look back at them and think, you know, that they are fundamental mistakes. And if you're going to win, you know, people seven. can have a go at us for keep mentioning it, but if you're going to be a world champion, you're not going to win them with mistakes as many as it's been. has proved to be the master of brinksmanship in this world championship so far survive six match darts against Darren Webster is he going to survive going three sets to nil down to Andy Smith and still re-emerge after Christmas when uh, Adrian Lewis won his first world title it was two sets to nil down to Nigel Hayden you'll recall Rod and uh, battled back to win 3-2 history would be very different if Nigel Hayden had gone on with it and knocked the future champ out and James Wade maybe he will be the future champ I don't think there's many tournaments that, that any player wins without having a bit of luck on the way I said this to Eric earlier on, and he said it actually back his five world championships. He didn't, no one got close to him and had a dart and a double. But there are obviously certain things that happen in early sets that, that turn it towards you. Oh, the great Bristow did not rely on luck. Set it up here. 
Well, this year's UK Open, Brendan Dolan had three darts at double and wired them all to knock Phil Taylor out who went to win the tournament. So even the great man himself needs a little bit of luck on occasion. This crucial for Andy Smith. Big 18 requires maximum concentration. Tops. 98. James Rickard. Level the match rod here. 72, 72 uh, points away from doing so. Well, he had the 96 that he missed. Andy Smith has just missed the 118. So now 16 for Tops for a set to level it up for James Wade. And he's gone and missed the anguish on James Andy Wade's Rickard. face. And Smith comes back for double 10 himself to level it up and to stay in the set. And it is level. Well, that's twice in this match that James Wade has missed a set dart. He missed double ten to win the third set, which he lost. And he has just missed double top to win the sixth set. Will he lose this also? And if he does, he loses the match, remember. Well, I know what the pie man's thinking now, Rodders. Just give me a 12-dart leg. Come on, let me hit the treble, let me get the rhythm nice and smooth. I think he's also thinking it's blooming hot up here. 16. Well, that will never change. The big stages, I can assure you, are extremely hot, well over 100 degrees. Well, he's doing the right thing, Pi, isn't he? He's got the towel up there, he's toweling down before every throw. Thing you want is a bit of sweat on your fingers or some perspiration on your brow putting you off. Sixteen. Was unlucky that third dart. In fairness. Ninety-eight. Well, in the early part of the game, we said that James Wade's making it very easy for Andy Smith to get into that three sets to nil lead. Since then, the pie man made it quite easy for James Wade to get back in the game. 100. And now he's going to have at least six, probably nine darts from 207. To go to the deciding set. And we've had a few this week. We've had a couple of tie break games. 83. Of course, one, Bo Anderson and Colin Lloyd to the, the very last leg. Absolutely. Oh, tense tussle last night, Mark Webster. Just about getting James home against Big John Henderson. But he doesn't need to go looking for a bullseye finish here. Let's do the sensible thing. 84. Cool customer. Ideal setup. Leaves tops. That target, if he hits it. Will mean from 3 0 down, James Wade is level at 3 all. 100. Come back in. Firing at double top. Game seven is six. Full square. James Wade. Come back in. Seven. Has done it again. Set. First leg. 